Hey, 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 Libra, this is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your Wednesday, September 9th to the 10th, Intuitive Love Tarot Read. This is for my Libras, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you guys today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Libra, if you would, before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your like, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading with me, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. The link to my Etsy shop is there. I'm going to grab some cards here and then get a channeled message for you from Spirit. Ooh, we've got the Sun. Queen of Cups. What else from Libra? Wow. King of Pentacles. Judgment. And the Ten of Cups. Holy schmoly, Libra. King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Look at these freaking people. Who also had, I think Aries had a lot of people. So if you got Aries in your chart, Go watch the Aries reading. Okay. Let's get this message from Spirit Libra. Delegate the things that need to be done, Libra. If you are like a boss, if you are... Okay, they're even showing me a family. Okay, if you're the family boss, right? They're saying delegate the things that need to be done. You don't have to do it all by yourself. Okay, they're saying don't do it all by yourself. Okay, you're going to you're going to wear yourself out. You're going to burn yourself out. So you need to ask for help. Don't wear yourself out because yeah, Libra, you're going to you're going to become unbalanced. And an unbalanced Libra is not a fun Libra. All right? Sacral Chakra. All right, Libra, look on YouTube for meditations for your sacral chakra. Your sacral chakra is orange. Okay? Try to eat orange foods. Um it's creativity and it's also sexual. So they're one of the same energy. So do something creative, um, have sex, uh, but really try to clear that sacral chakra. There's some sort of uh, blockage there of some sort, but it's like it wants to be activated. It's like itching to come out. Okay, thank you. Well, that was mighty specific. Go buy yourself some oranges, Libra. Up. Okay. Or carrots. You've got, wow, this is incredible here. You've got happiness galore here, right? I feel like there could be somebody coming into your life, a Cancer Scorpio Pisces, that is your happiness that is going to make you extremely happy it's going to make you feel like a child again you're gonna they're saying giddy you're gonna feel giddy this emotional fulfillment will be present from the get-go they're saying now for some of you it could be somebody from the past but for some of you I'm getting it's a new person a soulmate from a past life yes but you also have the reunion card here across from the Taurus card. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So for some of you, it could be a reunion. For some of you, um, for a lot of you, I do feel it's new. This is going to help open your heart chakra. Huh. Okay. This is one of the reasons why they want you to clear your sacral chakra. It's like preparing yourself for this person tell me about the sun here this is leo energy could be a leo it 
Now they, they're giving me the song, You Are the Sunshine of My Life. Stevie Wonder. Wow. That's such an, I, I love that song. Seven of Wands. This is going to be somebody that is going to be willing to fight for you. Right? I feel that this person is bringing with them a lot of healing energy. And this is what you're going to be responding to. This sort of peaceful presence that they have. You're really going to enjoy like sort of bathing in their presence. Wow. Ooh, they just gave me this. Ooh, they just said Kundalini. Kundalini rising. You may feel something in the spinal area when you when you meet this person. If this is person from the present, tell me about the Queen of Cups. Knight of Cups. Yeah, you're opening your heart, but you're taking it slow. Okay? I think they are too. Tell me about the Ten of Cups. This is emotional stability. This is emotional happiness. This is just joy. I'm getting joy, glee, glee. Uh, hella sexual attraction here. And a new cycle for you in relation to love. It, this is going to feel like a breath of fresh air for you, Libra. Two death. Seven of swords. Don't run away from what is in front of you. Have the strength to deal with the emotions that you are feeling. Here you are with the, queen, uh, the king of swords. Don't cut this short. Okay. Clear that sacral chakra, please, okay? And also meditate, because I feel like for some of you, this may, I don't want to say scare you a little. You may not want to deal with it, with the devil energy and the seven of swords here. Don't run away, okay? Just take it slow, take it slow. Two of Pentacles with the Judgment card. Three of Pentacles. Mm. Okay. For some of you, for some of you, if you're dating somebody, this person may come along while you're dating somebody. Okay. And you're going to have to decide. I do feel you're going to choose this person because it's like, it's like a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer. It just is. Because this is this is strong. Strength. Yeah. See? Okay. Tell me more about this person. This person could be at a distance with the Eight of Wands here, but there are going to be a lot of passionate messages and a lot of passion that's going to be flowing between you and this person. And I am feeling like Emperor Empress. I feel like it may be your divine counterpart. Five of Cups. This person is coming from um, a place of regret from past relationships. Regret regarding the amount of energy that they put into those past relationships. Okay. So they are going to want to take this slow. They may not divulge this at first, but that's what I'm getting. So there may be some confusion on their part. Okay? They're going to be scared just like you, Libra. It's like you're, you're going to be on the same wavelength there. Hopefully you guys are going to feel comfortable enough to communicate this with each other, communicate this to each other, okay? King of Wands. So I feel like this person makes you feel very confident, Libra. Very confident. Like you can do anything. So what is your advice for Libra? Yeah, get out of your head. Don't run away from this. Okay, there's no reason to be anxious about it. That's temporary. Okay, because this person feels the connection just like you do. 
If that's not being um, expressed, I'm telling you right now, they do. It's just as strong for them as it is for you. Nine of Cups. Yes, it's your wish fulfillment. Five of Swords. There is no reason to be jealous if you if you meet this person, right? Like I said, you're dating. They could be dating. You may be a little jealous if you do find out they're dating, even if you just go out on one date, because that connection is there. Okay, but you, you have to express this. Don't keep it in because it's going to lead to this Five of Swords energy and that's it's going to come out in an unhealthy way. Okay, it's sort of pettiness and, and anger. And you just, it's not warranted because there is a lot to celebrate here. Yeah, communication, clarity, and truth needs to happen between the both of you. Okay. Let's get some messages. Whoever you want messages from, let's see. Play. I just want to have fun with you. Walls. I feel like I can't get through to you. Please let me in. And that could be either of you. Ego. It's easier to block everything out right now. I'd rather ignore my emotions. Yes, that's that seven of swords. Don't do that. Don't do it. It's like self-sabotage. Don't self-sabotage this, okay? Stubborn. Dot, dot, dot. You both could be stubborn. That's shared energy. All right. Libra, I hope that helped. I hope it resonated. Please drop a like below. Share and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading with me, that way this is more specific to you and your needs and your questions. Information is in the description box below to my Etsy shop. Have yourself a fabulous day, Libra, and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.